Hello and welcome to another indie horror game. This time I'll be playing a game called The Diving Bell, and if you want to get it for yourselves, look down below in the description, I'll leave the links and the details all down there, alright? Now, in The Diving Bell, all I really have to do is I need to finish writing a report. The only thing is, I'm writing this report at the bottom of the ocean depths, in a station nearly 10 kilometers underwater. And it seems like even in the menu, before we've even started the game, I can hide, which is somewhat alarming. Huh. Maybe I'm under threat already. I hope not. Nothing's happened quite yet, but uh, let's get on with it, shall we? Let's begin the report. Hope you enjoy it. Type assist 2. Okay. Yeah, let's begin. Alright, so December 22nd, 1993. And I shouldn't have pressed that key. <laughs> Alright, so let's see. Report author Gregory Foss. Base state is critical. Okay, so personnel involved. Uh, there's Gregory Foss, Saul Riskowicz. Alex Carraway, Lysander Hughes, and Don Houston. Crew dead, four. Mechanical failure, okay. Is that like a computer error? I don't think so. Am I hallucinating? I think that's my heart rate in the bottom left. It didn't fluctuate at all. I've got some pills, which is great. But, uh, I don't know, maybe I'm just used to the hallucinations. <laughs> anyway. Um, the incident report. At 3pm today, during a scheduled transfer from the land research base to Diving Bell W95, an explosive decompression incident occurred. Crew members Riskerich, Carraway, Hughes and Houston had earlier been ordered to staff the Diving Bell for the mechanical failure again. Yep, now this is happening to me, it's not on the screen. This is very strange. Very, very strange indeed. Let's continue. Yes, uh, they had earlier been ordered to staff the diving bell for the purpose of a research expedition into the Redwater Crevasse, during which they would collect samples and photographs of the flora, fauna, and minerals found in those depths. All four base members were in the umbilical connecting land base to the... Whoa, jeez! Okay. Yeah, this is going to be a hard report to write. <laughs> <laughs> in the umbilical connecting land base to the diving bell when one of the automatic pressure regulation mechanisms failed. This mechanism, which normally equalizes the pressure in the umbilical with the water pressure outside, had to be manually overridden by crew member Thos, who I think is me, uh, base contact for the research crew. When prompted to complete his manual override... Anomaly 200 meters? Jesus Christ, that's one hell of an anomaly. But that's not going to bother me. Let's continue, shall we? Uh, this isn't my fault. This isn't my fault. God damn it. This isn't my fault. This isn't my fault. It's not my fault. I just couldn't. I just couldn't. I didn't mean it. I... Okay. All right. Calm down. Calm down. Let's continue. Base status critical. Report. Uh, would like to apologize for breach of professionalism in yesterday's report. As team leader, any failure is on my shoulders. If rescued, I will cooperate with company prosecution to the fullest extent. I'm beginning to worry, however, that there will be no chance to prosecute me. Rescue possibilities are slim, and growing slimmer. The incident yesterday seems to have affected the ocean floor. I think some kind of tectonic shift has occurred, destabilizing the base. The facility is holding together, but electrical and mechanical difficulties... Oh, here we go. Oh, that's a real one this time! Now I need to go and check heating. Right, I've got to go to heating. Fuck, right, so tab to leave. Okay. So we're not just stuck to the console. That's really quite nice. Guidance. Okay, that's cute. Brilliant. Alright. So we got some more. Yep. We got some more pills there. That's great. What's this down here? Don't look outside for too long. Sometimes you think you see things. Active imagination is not good in these depths. Thos. And that's actually me making a note for myself. Well, what am I going to do? I've, I've got to look outside, haven't I? <laughs> what was that anomaly? 200 meters. Was that real? I can barely see a thing. Can we get some music going? I like this, by the way. Nice style. Nah, I don't think it's going to work. Anyway, check heating. Right. Uh, so, where's that precisely? Sample collection that way. Generator room? Oh, hang on. Oh, I see. It's on some sort of, like, airlock system. I was just trying to raise it, actually. Okay, let's go under it. Right. I think I'm going to the right section. Okay, let's see. Oh, I see. So, 
It's uh, it's R to reduce my anxiety. Great. Generators are all active. That's good. Okay. Company cannot guarantee your safety. Okay, life support. Let's just have a little look around. Let's get used to the base. We'll probably be coming back and forth quite a lot. So, that's the life support machine. It seems to be doing something. It's keeping me alive. Oh, okay. Oh! Oh, this is actually quite big. So there's two floors. Um, generator room. I'm in life support. So if I go through a door, I'll get to a staircase. Uh, it looks like I need to go up to floor two to get to the boiler room, so... Oh, can I get the axe? No. It's actually quite hard to see at certain angles because of the light, but... Right. Yeah, okay, so up the stairs to floor two. Everything looks okay out there, I think. Actually, I'm not so sure about that. Anyway, electrical room, okay, so... Yep, that's good, that's good. We need to go to the room connected to this, though, really. The boiler room. So, we got switches, transformers... Everything's green, everything looks like it's okay, for now. Right. That's the note. Caraway. Boiler's been on the fritz again. So much for wanting to help with the technical stuff. How many beers you owe me now? 20? 30? Well, if I ain't here, the fixing's on you. I don't give a goddamn if it ain't your damn job. Spare parts are over in comms. Figure it out. Left some AAs over there too. If all the loud noises in here have scared you too bad. Right, so there's going to be a replacement fuse in communications, apparently. Right, so communications... Ah, da, 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 da. It's also on floor two. Um, I need to cross back through the atrium. Looks like I can do that. Ah, is this machine here? Right. It's missing, isn't it? <laughs> Got ya. Okay, right. Well, I, I will be back in a moment. I, uh, I just need to go this way, I guess. Is so bright. <laughs> okay. Yeah, probably shouldn't be looking outside. Okay, that is a weird effect. It looks like the entirety of the atrium is underwater because I'm sort of looking towards the windows there. It's okay though. It's okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We're not drowning. It's cool. It's cool. Right, so it should be on this side? Like, right ahead of me, essentially. Yeah. Okay. Here we are, the communications room. Let's take a look for a fuse, shall we? And loads more pills, apparently. Thank you very much. Haven't actually needed to use any yet, but that's good. Looks like there's another note down here. Uh, Riskowitch, look, I know it gets really boring down here. I really do. But experimenting with our anti-anxiety meds is a bad idea, even for you. It might mellow you out for a little, but if we ain't got them when we need them, if, say, Houston has another one of his breakdowns, there could be trouble. I won't tell Thos, but get it together, man. Do some laps around the base or something. And that's from Caraway. Okay. Okay, I'm not actually... Oh, hang on. Something down here. Okay. Oh. Oh, look, hang on. Oh dear. Okay, yep. I, I, I didn't see that. I didn't see that. I'm going to take a pill. Right. Yeah. Was, uh, was that a dead crew member that I saw there? <laughs> I'm curious. I want to look, but I don't want to look because it affects my uh, anxiety. Okay, so... It was green, so it goes in the green slot. Yes! Yeah? Okay, I should head back to my terminal. Corporate likes their logs immaculate. Helps them avoid litigation. And typing helps pass the time. I'm sure it does, yeah. Well, that was a little creepy. Okay. So, around here we go. These are all the typical noises that I'm expecting to hear, yeah? I think so. <laughs> okay. Just out of interest, yeah, before we go back to the terminal and continue, 
Oh yeah, the door's broken. Uh, what else have we got access to? There's the sample collection over here. Alright. Well, yeah, it looks like some coral samples. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Uh, through here, what do we got? Looks like water. Data center. Pre oh, I think we're actually going out into the depths. Uh, I need a pressure suit. Ooh. Are we actually going out? I kind of hope so. Through here we have the living quarters and they're locked for whatever reason. Huh, okay. Right. Anyway, yeah, back to here. Yeah, let's see. Uh, there was a log update. Uh, log interrupted by system failure. Parts of base are currently inaccessible and systems are not behaving as they should. Distress call from the comms room beacon has not been acknowledged. Current work case plan of action will be to repair one of the high-pressure diving suits, using it to make the journey to Diving Bell W95. Uh, on a personal note, I think the situation may be affecting my... another actual mechanical failure. The beacon in communications, just where I was. Okay, uh, sure. <laughs> it's not gonna be easy. <laughs> so, here we go. Back through here. There's a stairwell. Unfortunately, I don't have access to that area, though. I'm going the long way around. Alright, so... Through here... Avert your eyes and move to safety if something causes you distress. Right. Like, something outside, or alarm bells? Okay, so hang on, what's that say? Shit. <laughs> well, I guess it wasn't too important if it's not still happening. Maybe I was imagining it. But yeah, there uh, there might be some sort of anomaly outside. I don't know. To the left, right? That's it. <laughs> this thing? Uh, the distress beacon? What do we got? Oh. Just connect the wires? That seems to have worked. Okay! When I was alive, I oh dear. Oh shit. Oh shit. Sorry, Hughes. Nope. Nope. I can still hear him, but at least my anxiety isn't actually getting worse. My embrace of religion was that of a child huddled beside a night fight. And when you killed me, I didn't kill you. It was a mistake, man. I'm sorry. Why don't you come out and join us? Oh, I'd love to, oh, but... Ah, oh. oh, sorry. In person. My God, why are you Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Right. Okay. Yeah. Return to terminal. Let's just finish that and let's just finish the report and pretend that never happened. Yeah. I think the situation may be affecting my psyche. I just saw something I could not possibly have seen at depths like these. Though this situation is uh, is my is not my fault. It's not. It's not. I ask the command, please consider the stress of these circumstances once the investigative probe is launched. I was looking forward to spending Christmas with my wife and child. Why would I not fail? Not failed when I did didn't if I was scheduled to return to the mainland today. Please excuse the rambling, Command. Not feeling well. Going to bed. Okay. Did you go to bed? How did you do that? The door was locked. <laughs> well, it looks like it's now Christmas Eve, so... Ah, uh, yeah, Gregory Thos again. Don't let them see your shame. And we gotta hide. Okay. It seems like control actually does type as well, so I can continuously hide and type. <laughs> Alright, so again, base status is critical. Base still holds for now. No response to distress call yet. Beginning to consider my escape options more thoroughly. Oh god, I'm hiding, I'm hiding. I didn't read that. It's not happening. It's not happening. It seems like I dropped some of the pills as well. I don't think I used all of those, did I? Everything okay? Everything okay. Uh, uh, yeah, beginning to consider my escape options more thoroughly. A personal note, please forgive the intrusion, Command. I think I slept last night, if it was night and if I did sleep. If I did, the incident 
that wasn't my fault was all I could think of. The others stood close around me, speaking of things they couldn't have known at the- ah, ah. Power fluctuation? A genuine power fluctuation? Got to check electrical. What was that thing? There was something outside. I think it was another one of my crewmates. Okay. Time to check electrical. It's, uh, it's an area that I've been to before. This wasn't here before, was it? Maybe it was. Houston, I don't like writing this, but I'm going to need an explanation for your conduct over the past few days. Briskowitch and Caraway said that you've been twitchy and hostile. They think you analyzed one of the drill unit samples and found something strange. And frankly, I think you're scaring them. And oh god, I'm getting I'm getting fucked up reading this. Okay, there was I think that was probably something outside again. Right, let's go back to that. Uh, frankly, I think you're scaring them. I want to vouch for you, I really do, but I can't if you don't tell me what's going on in your head. Come find me and let's talk. If you need more, okay, alright. Skim in the rest of it because I don't want to die. Right, through here. Oh, what? Oh, this door's malfunctioning now. Oh, okay, uh, I'm taking the long way around, which would be... to, well, the, the living quarters, I guess. That's got to be available. Right, let's grab those pills. As it turns out, I'm gonna need them. Yeah, it works. I guess I unlocked it during my uh, my stint last night. So we've got a pressure chamber, another broken door. That's the drop off, right? Definitely don't want to go out there. Everything seems okay, but man, looking into that abyss, it's not very comforting, is it? It approaches... Oh, shit. What are you talking about? What approaches? 2,000? 2,000 meters. Holy shit. Okay. What's this? Okay, a uh, big pulley wheel. Did, did I just pick that up? I think I just picked that up. Hey, look. There's the suit. In the repair station. This thing will be my ticket out of here once it's not full of holes. Okay. Ah... Uh, can we get this started? Is it repairing? Oh, oh, this goes out of the diving belt. Okay, sure. Well, this isn't where we want to be. We want to be in electrical, don't we? But still, I'm just going to have a little look around. So... Right, this would be to the staircase, I think? Yeah. Oh, the stairs are locked. It's not turning, which means it's been sealed. Hopefully the lift down the hall still runs off the emergency grid at the other end, okay. Uh, let's have a look at the mess hall and the labs, though. So, the mess hall, yeah. More pills! Lovely. Okay. What does this mean? These weird symbols. Huh. Oh, I wonder. Can I grab one of these knives? Each one is duller than the last, not fit for cutting bread, and yet I'm almost tempted to take one. Alright, I don't think there's much else here. There's the door out to the diving bell area, I guess. Okay, so yeah, let's close that one. Med bay's open as well. Another strange symbol. What's going on down here? Okay, I got a pulley belt now. Okay. And there's a note down here by the looks of it. Uh, Caraway, I had the same dream that you were talking about, or something real similar. I went to bed sober as a stone, too. And there's an extra bit. A weird extra bit. When I woke up, I had something in my hand. A page. It looked like it had been torn out of a Bible. Something don't feel right down here anymore. Insofar as it ever did. And that's from Riskowitch. Okay. Wow. Whoa. Okay. Hang on. I can't take the axe, but I can have a look at the very bright note. I'll skip the part where I tell you that I'm beyond sick and tired of telling you people to remember the damn override code for electrical. Here it is. 1890. You get that this time? 1890. It's 1890. 1890. One more than 1889, and one less than 1891. Now that you remember that, I have this to say. If one more of you bastards wakes me up at two in the morning to ask me what the code is, I'm going to murder you with an axe. 
don't test me, Hughes. Someone tested him. <laughs> Christ. Okay, so nothing else in here. Anything? Oh, there's actually some more pills down here, so that's pretty good. And this door works. Okay. Uh, so that's still the mess hall, right? So here we are, the service lift, and that's it. It works. Okay. Right, it's still got power. Yeah, it's it's missing parts. Ah, two flywheels and a belt to fix the elevator. Oh, I see. It's still broken though. Right, I only found the one wheel. I need to find another flywheel. Yeah, it seems like it. Okay, well, it's got to be somewhere in the atrium, I suppose. Or... Well, we can't get to the mechanical area, can we? Nothing there. Um, what about that area to the left? Is that still unlocked? Sample collection? I don't actually... <laughs> Where the fuck did this come from? And surely that's heavy enough to smash that case. Well... I think that was it, though. I, I think that's the wheel I was looking for. I'm noticing more and more of these drawings. All with sort of, like, esoteric symbols and... Yeah. There's definitely something fishy down here. <laughs> Pun intended. It lives! Time to head upstairs. Right, so it works? Yeah. There's something out there. It knows I'm here. It knows everything about me. Stop. Okay. That's what the pills are for. Stop thinking like that. Okay, so the second floor of the living quarters. There's a... Let's see. The lavatory? Okay. Crew quarters? Alright, well, let's have a look at the lavatory, shall we? How bold of you to presume safety in that tomb of glass and steel of yours. <laughs> Under these pressures, with its flavor, supports buckle, and glass cracks. How long do you think you have left? I, like you, had a family, dead before me. I have been promised I can see them again, and I believe those promises more than the empty words of the free world. You should think about that. You've noticed the presence. I can see it on you. Haven't you always wanted to be part of something greater? <laughs> Shit. It was why you joined the company in the first place. I think you'll soon be very pleased. The Death's Call. Won't you listen? Oh, I'm listening. I can't help but listen. Right. Is he gone? I hope he's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Okay. Alright. Anyway. Electrical. Yeah. Right. We're nearly there. <laughs> uh, so here we are. Comms room. Okay. So I've pretty much had a look at everywhere. Aside from like the stairwell, I guess. And uh, the outside areas. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, I should probably just like walk looking at my feet, my non-existent feet. So, uh, you know, I don't actually notice anything in the corner of my eye and my anxiety gets worse. Right, electrical. Uh, the boiler room. Okay, so it's actually just through here, isn't it? Oh, it's these things. They were green before. No, it's not getting to the transformers. Check the generator terminal. Ah, uh, where's that? The terminal's in here somewhere? Hang on. No, that's the, that's the boiler. Oh, the general. Oh, I see. Yeah, I remember now. Yeah, it's, it's down here, isn't it? Uh, yeah, okay. Did I do that? Did I, did I take the axe? I'm losing my marbles down here. That much is evident, but 
the reason why, I'm not so sure. There might be something more to this. Right, okay, they're not all green anymore. So we're, uh, we're lacking a few things, aren't we? Ah, what was that code again? Do I want an axe to the head? I don't think so. So let's just put in 1890. Yeah, sweet. Uh, which one? Let's see, uh, restart one. Let's just restart them all. Oh shit. Oh shit. I kind of want to look, but I don't want to look. Okay. Fuck. It seems like I can only take the pills when I'm hiding. Anyway, that, that one's been restarted too. Okay. Still restarting. That's good. That's good. What about three or four? Four? That one there. Okay, it's back up and running. And three. That one's the one over there. Yeah. All generators active. Ah, oh, okay. So the transformers also do need to be configured a little bit. I think the switches just need to be flipped. So, sweet. Okay. I'm actually quite liking this game so far. It's uh, it's kind of rough around the edges, but I'm liking the concept, the story. If you hadn't guessed yet, this is another game you can find on the second Dread X collection, which so far has been pretty impressive. I've liked all the games I've played on it so far. Right. Here we are. No? Oh. Oh, there's a specific order we need to do them in? It's gotta be this one, then. Yeah. Then that one? Sure. <laughs> okay, yeah, I need to finish my log. Of course. Um... Can I... Can I take the shortcut back? Is the door now operational because I've got everything running again? I hope so. I really hope so. This is open. Hey! Okay, this is working! Brilliant. It's working properly, too. Yay! Right. No more spooky shit, guys. All right. Here we go. <coughs> Amendment. Another system failure. Electric this time. The other crew members linger outside the base. I think they blame me for what happened, which they shouldn't. Accidents happen. Accidents happen. Accidents happen. It's Christmas Eve. And I... It, oh, he's... He's swimming by. The bastard. Is he gone? He's gone. I was supposed to be home by now. Extension ordered at the last minute last week. I've been in these depths for nine months. Well, that's why he's losing his marbles. Holy shit. I haven't seen my wife. My kid's forgetting what I look like. I'm supposed to get holidays off. I should be on our warm bed or crouched beneath the Christmas tree with Zayna, uh, organizing the presents so that they don't stick out and make the dog think that it'd be a good idea to tear into them. But instead, I'm going to die down here. You'll the fucking hell. I don't know who that was, but one of them's out there, peering in, watching me. I feel very much like a goldfish doing it here. Can't we do this a little bit more privately? Can't I do... Why don't we have curtains or shutters or blinds or something? Anyway. Yeah, uh, you'll destroy these logs, but before you do, you better read every word. Know what happened down here. No, oh, fuck. Could you leave me alone, please? Okay, thank you. <laughs> he actually listened. Uh, know what happened down here. None of this is my fault. It's yours. It's the manufacturer's. Why wasn't there a failsafe for the automatic doors? Why is there a manual override? I didn't... I did push the button. Another mechanical failure killed the others. Not me. Maybe throwing myself out of the airlock is a good idea, after all. Oh, here we go. Rescue isn't coming, but I'm getting out of here. My diving suit's damaged, but there's a machine. I need to repair it. What the fuck? These are very, very concerning symbols. Goodness gracious me. Okay, there's a note down here. I didn't see this last time. Riskowich. Took the failsafe part. I'm sorry. Couldn't be helped. Had to. Go to the bell. Save yourself. From Carraway. Right. Oh, these are Houston's fish, apparently. Okay, I'm just looking for any more pills. There you go. Okay. I'm going to ignore that negativity in the top right. Oh, Jesus. Oh, shit. Okay, it, does this still work? 
Uh, I don't know if it does, to be honest. Oh, oh, okay, hang on. No, nope, it does. Don't need to replace the flywheels or anything, no? It's all good. It's all good. Sweet, okay. So, just down at the very end, through the door and around. That's it. Okay. Back to the living quarters. There's more and more of these. Uh, maybe I missed a few of them earlier on, but I didn't miss them all. Christ, okay, hang on, hang on. There we go, I'm, all, I'm pilled up now. Right, down here. Okay, so let's see if we can repair this. It's gonna take a while, I should... <laughs> I should write a log. No, we've written enough logs. Oh god, what's happening now? What's happening now is that I'm going to read this, actually, because I haven't seen this before. Thos, I got the repair machine up and working, as per your insistent requests. Sorry I tore your suit up the first time. Not really sure what happened. Miscalculation, I guess. It should be able to patch up your suit, but it'll take a while. I get you like your personal space, but during transferal, maybe you should just use one of ours. Otherwise, you won't be diving for quite some time. It's fucking okay with me. Is that just a ring out there? It's just a ring. Nothing to be alarmed about. <laughs> I like that it says finish your last log, guilt ridden, rotted meat. Right, okay. <laughs> I just thought, holy shit, the atrium's flooded, but no. I went to the wrong door. Am I going to find some pills to the right again? Yes, okay, and oh. Oh, fucking hell, really? There too. What is going on? I must be doing this while I'm sleeping. Right, let's get through this. It's Christmas Day after all. Oh shit. <laughs> exactly, just got to hold out. Can I type and hide at the same time? Unfortunately, I can't. Not even if I'm looking at it. Shit. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, the author is the same as it's been the last two times. Not like anyone else would write anything down. I don't know what just happened. My readout says that hours have passed, but I've been sitting here this entire time. But not the whole time. There was not quite a vision of something filling my head. More like an impression, the outline. I can't explain it. A dark something fills the crevasse. It... Oh, fuck. Oh, the Transformers again? Are you serious? <laughs> here we go. Okay, shit, right. The, uh, the ghosts of my friends, they're getting more aggressive, it seems. Does it really? Ah! Right. Maybe I can ignore the unfortunate truth of what's going on and do to you what I've been told. But nobody ever mistook the Ritzkowitz for an opportunist. Don't misunderstand. I'll drag you out of your house and still count the same as the rest of us. You were supposed to keep us safe, and you didn't. I'm sorry. the Viper's payment. Fair is fair. But if you cooperate, don't struggle. I'll kill you outright. Do what I can to spare you the fate you consigned us to. It's almost more than you deserve. But I guess it doesn't matter who deserves what any longer. Oh, j oh fuck, not life support as well! Oh, if I don't fix it right now, I might not make it out of here. Okay, gotta fix that. Definitely gotta fix that. Life support, life support. That was that weird machine in this direction, wasn't it? Next to the generator room. That's right, that's right, okay. God damn, is it. Do, do I not have a. Oh, here it is. Done! I'm not writing my last will. The last words of a man who will live on. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm very conflicted. Right, I, I don't know if I can just rush and get the suit already. Right. I can feel it tapping in the darkness below. There's one concern I've got, those long, slender appendages in the earth. They're all beneath the base, and so long that they could easily wrap around it or wriggle in the open water. 
so they could easily have found their ways into the walls of the base. But why haven't I seen them, if that's the case? Are they tampering with the electronics? Or could it be something? Or someone else? 200 meters, fucking hell. I don't like this. I have one other persistent, burning thought. But no, it can't be. I won't accept it. There's nothing reading this but me. Alright, I'm ready. I think I can get to that godforsaken bell. With the respiratory tank attached to the suit, I should be able to withstand the pressure long enough to get there. Assuming I can get to the bell before the pressure collapses it. Assuming the bell is still beside the base and hasn't fallen into the crevasse. Assuming nothing grabs me while I'm out here. This will be my last log. Zayna, Addy, I'm coming home one way or another. Boy, oh boy. You've really been having a rough go of it, eh? <laughs> Stuck down here with just the four of us for days upon days. Not a word from the surface, not a ray of sunshine. Just the depths and the dark and the dank. And if that weren't bad enough, then you go and decide to blow us all out into open water. I didn't the mean to. 200 atmospheres bearing down on us. Our deaths were instant. But you bet your sorry ass they weren't famous. I'm sorry. Now I know and you know that this isn't new to you. You already knew all this. But I'm going to let you in on a oh, little shit. secret. I'm not looking at that. That guilt that you've been pretending like you don't have? The paralytic, mind-numbing horror of what you've done? All those logs you spent all that time writing? That's all been according to plan. Oh. Our new friend's got all the details it needs on. Now all you two have to do is meet. Your new friend? I'm sure you'll get along swimmingly. Ha! <laughs> Pun intended, I'm sure. Alright, so down we go. Down we go. Let's go meet this new friend of yours. As I head towards the bell and hopefully get back to the surface. Okay, I had to go the long way around, unfortunately, but uh, it's okay, it's okay. I still got a few pills. The suit should be repaired by now, right? Yeah? That's it, right? That's the bell, I think? It looks kind of like a bell. That's where I'm going, it's not too far away, right. Yeah! Well, I hope it's repaired, because I'm wearing it now. Ah, uh, okay. Here we go. We're out of here. Okay, so just down here. Can I just get across there? That'd be great. What's this? Oh, why am I turning? Why are you making me turn? Oh, guys. No. No. Come on. Fight it. Fight it. Fight. Oh, God. Whoa. What the fuck is that? Uh. Oh. Oh, that's your friend? Oh, dear. I didn't quite make it to the bell. And there I was, thinking I'd never see my family again. I should have had faith. Zaina, Addy, your smiling faces are all I've wanted to see for so long. We're finally together. Jesus Christ! <laughs> Merry Christmas! Is that how it's meant to look? That actually looks like a glitch to me. Maybe it is. It's like the textures have just been pulled out and stretched, but maybe these are these long, slender tentacles. It's a weird look. Could I have made it to the diving bell? Shit. I don't know if I could. But there you go, that was the diving bell, and I actually enjoyed that a great deal. I would like to see this sort of remade and remastered so it doesn't look so rough around the edges because I think you've got something really really good here it just doesn't look as good as I think it, it could or it should um, yeah with some improvements I think this could be a real real winner but yeah there you go thanks for watching all right so December 22nd 1993 and I shouldn't have pressed that key <laughs> land base to the Oh, jeez! That is so bright. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, yep. 
I, I didn't see that. I didn't see that. The beacon in communications, just where I was. Okay. Ah, uh, sure. <laughs> it's not going to be easy. <laughs> okay. So, hang on. What's that say? Shit. <laughs> well, I guess it wasn't too important. When I was alive, I oh, dear. Hear the oh shit. Did you go to bed? How did you do that? The door was locked. <laughs> it seems like control actually does type as well, so I can continuously hide and type. <laughs> the others stood close around me, speaking of things they couldn't have known. At the, ah, ah. And frankly, I think you're scaring them. And oh god, I'm getting, I'm getting fucked up reading this. I'm going to murder you with an axe. Don't test me, Hughes. Someone tested him. <laughs> I don't actually... Where the fuck did this come from? There's definitely something fishy down here. <laughs> Pun intended. Oh shit. I kind of want to look, but I don't want to look. It's Christmas Eve, and I... It, oh, he's... He's swimming by. The bastard. Know what happened down here. No, oh, fuck. Could you leave me alone, please? Okay, thank you. <laughs> he actually listened. It's gonna take a while. I should <laughs> I should write a log note. We've written enough logs. Ah. <laughs> but I'm going to let you in on a little shit. Sequence. I'm not looking at that. Whoa, what the fuck is that? Ah. Uh, oh. We're finally together. Jesus Christ. <laughs>